Tesla just made two silent moves that completely changed the trajectory of humanoid robots. First, Optimus started running inside Tesla's lab. Second, Tesla revealed a new advanced Optimus AND at NER IPS 2025. Both updates look small. Both are massive. Let's break down why. The gold Optimus running footage wasn't a polished marketing video. It was a raw, controlled lab clip, and that's exactly what makes it credible. Running isn't just faster walking. It requires real-time balance correction, rapid sensor processing, predictive motor control, and millisecond-level actuator precision. Optimus version 2.5 showed stable posture, consistent stride timing, and proper weight transfer through each step. Most humanoid robots fail at this stage. They stumble, lose balance, or require heavy external support. Optimus didn't. This proves Tesla has crossed a major threshold in dynamic locomotion. But mobility is only half the story. At NER IPS 2025, Tesla quietly revealed what might be the most important upgrade so far, the new Optimus hand. This isn't a simple gripper. The new hand introduces higher degrees of freedom, tendon-driven actuation, improved tactile sensing, more accurate fingertip force control, and faster neuromuscular-style response loops. In simple terms, the robot can now feel, adjust, and manipulate objects with significantly more human-like precision. This matters because real work doesn't happen with legs. It happens with hands. A robot that can run but can't manipulate objects is impressive. A robot that can do both becomes useful. And when you combine dynamic mobility with human-level dexterity, you don't just get a robot. You get a scalable labor platform. That's the real shift happening here. Tesla isn't showing off party tricks. They're building systems meant to work in factories, warehouses, labs, and eventually homes. And unlike most demos in robotics, this wasn't about spectacle. It was about quiet, repeatable engineering progress. Now let's zoom out. These updates didn't arrive with a massive product launch. No stage. No dramatic keynote. Just quiet footage and technical reveals. That's often how real breakthroughs look. While other companies focus on flashy demonstrations, Tesla is stacking foundational capabilities. And once those foundations lock in, the jump in capability doesn't look gradual. It looks exponential. Optimus running isn't just about speed. It's about control. The new hand isn't just about fingers. It's about intelligence at the point of contact. Together, they signal something bigger than a robot update. They signal the moment humanoid robots move from research to reality. We are no longer watching early experiments. We are watching the first generation of machines that can move and manipulate the world at human scale. And what Tesla just showed us isn't the end of the story. It's the opening chapter. Humanoid robots aren't coming. They're already learning how to work. If you enjoyed this breakdown and want more updates on the most advanced humanoid robots in the world, make sure to subscribe. More robotics insight and analysis is on the way.